guys! So today's video is going to be my box to share and unbox it. I haven't washed my hair in over a week and it's looking a little crusty. A little crusty, not gonna lie, but I'm washing it tonight. I swear. But uh, you already know the drill. Half of my makeup is on and we are diving in to this month's box. And the first thing we got is an eyeshadow palette. <laughs> this is from Violet Voss. It's called the Violet Sunset eyeshadow palette. I feel like I haven't seen Violet Voss in so long. This is definitely one of those like YouTube nostalgic brands. And this is their eyeshadow and press pigment palette. It's got really, really lovely colors. And really quickly, I'm gonna throw some on. We're gonna test out the formulas and see how I feel. So really quickly off camera, I applied some brown mascara from Thrive Cosmetics. And then my lip is actually a combo of two different lip liners. I'm wearing the Too Faced Lady Bold Lip Liner in Limitless Life and uh, the Jaclyn Cosmetics Lip Liner in Bourbon. They're just like mixed. I also added this little peach color on my inner corners. Oh, does one. And I really like it. Nice and sparkly, really pretty. But yeah, I really, really liked this eyeshadow palette. Even this shade right here called Champagne is so stunning. Like on the lid, it's just so sparkly and nice. All the colors blended really nicely. And I love that it's an everyday palette, but it still has this really pretty like pop of purple. So yeah, I really like that. I'm gonna hang on to this palette and use it from time to time. And then I'm the biggest idiot ever because I didn't realize that we had this product in the box. This is from a brand called Ace Beauty and it's the eyeshadow amplifying base in the shade Light, which is kind of like a P. Louise makeup base if you're familiar with those, I use them all the time. This is actually like very similar looking. I don't know if it's the same formula because those P. Louise eyeshadow bases are incredible, but it has like a similar color. Well, to one of the P. Louise bases. <laughs> but it's just one of those like creamy bases, you know. And this shade is like very, very light. I should have used this as a primer today so we can test if it's good or not. And I didn't even realize that. But I'm definitely gonna throw this onto my vanity and use it next time we do a music and makeup sesh over on my IG stories because I am dying to see if this is any good because it's supposed to intensify the eyeshadows that you put on top. And I'm very curious to see if that's true. Uh to be continued with this guy. So the next thing in the box, it's actually a skincare item. I used it right before I applied my makeup earlier today. And this is the Skin Fix Resurface AHA slash BHA Enzyme Exfoliating Pads. And they're basically just like little exfoliating pads that are supposed to retexturize your skin, like smooth out your skin, brighten your skin, remove dark spots, uneven skin tone, fine lines and wrinkles. Honestly, it sounds pretty freaking amazing. I've only used it once, of course, so I can't give you a review on it, but it did make my skin feel really nice. It didn't make it feel tight or super dry, which was my concern. It actually felt like nothing when I was done using it, but it's vegan, cruelty-free, it's alcohol-free, and it's supposed to be non-irritating. You can also use this on your body, which I thought was really awesome. And another cool thing about this is that the the little pads are biodegradable. I love little things like this. I like chemical exfoliators way more than physical exfoli exfoliators. So I'm gonna keep this on my sink and start using it. So yeah, thanks Boxysherm. Okay, and then the last two products are totes related. So we've got a brush set and a brush cleaner. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this brush cleaner that often because I am a ride or die. Biatch for the Beauty Blender soap. I love cleaning my makeup brushes with that solid soap. Beauty Blender is not the only brand that does it, but that's my preferred method of cleaning my brushes. I don't necessarily love like these spray things. <gasps> Wait, unless this is like the Cinema Secrets kind of brush cleaner. <gasps> Wait a second. Is this like a quick, fast brush cleaner? Or is this like a soapy liquid? Because if it's one of those like quick, fast ones, then I'm down with that. I'm down with that and I'll use it all the time. Okay, let's see, let's try it out. Maybe I should read up on it and then it'll tell me. <laughs> a quick and easy
easy way to cleanse and disinfect your artistry brushes. Okay, I think it is one of those like alcohol ones. Mm, smells nice. <gasps> it is. It is. Look, it's clean and dry. Oh, okay, I'll use this all the time, for sure. I'm actually almost out of my Cinema Secrets one. Okay, these kinds of brush cleansers are awesome. I love these. I thought for some reason it was like liquid soap. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not gonna do all that. I'm gonna use my bar of soap. I just go like this and I'm done. But no, see this, this is a lazy bitch's best friend. I like this. And then the last product are some brushes. Um, and these are from uh, Luxie. Luxie brushes, uh, we've gotten Luxie brushes in the past. I actually really enjoy Luxie brushes. They're pretty good. Um, and this is the Por La Noche collection. I like them, I like the colors. Like I like, I like this, I like this little Home Depot moment. I'm into it. Damn, I'm so dumb, why didn't I use this? Wow, today was an epic fail, huh? I was supposed to use, ah, uh, ignore that, okay? <laughs> it freaks me out too, but you know what? Makeup is expensive and I'm not gonna throw away my bronzer. Just because, you know, because it scares me. I could have used this on my inner core. I'm, I'm, I am just not, not, not doing good today. I hope you enjoyed me testing out literally half of the products. <laughs> Sorry about that, wow. This is actually a really good box this month. I love getting brushes, you know, like who doesn't like some, some brushes? Because I feel like they're just never products I invest in. I'm never like out there looking for new brushes, you know? So I'm glad we got that. This was a nice little palette, I enjoyed that. Super excited about this. Excited about new skincare. Hope that eyeshadow base works. This is a pretty freaking good box. Let me add everything together and let you know. Dang! 161 this is 50 bucks by itself Cojones. But anyway guys uh, that completes this video. I have to go wash my hair. <laughs> it's been too long It's been too long. My mom is already giving me the side eye like niña for favor. So I'm gonna go do that uh, Don't forget to leave me a comment down below letting me know what you got in your boxy shirt this month Did we get the same box? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Let me know. But yeah guys that completes this video If you hear little tick 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 all over the floor my dogs are walking everywhere and you know you know how that goes. But anyway guys, that completes this video. Oh my gosh, Cornelius almost knocked down my lamp. I'm in the middle of the, give me a second, I'm doing my intro. And my, out, my outro. But anyway guys, like I said, that completes this video. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so, so, so much. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye.